Hi developers, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil, and uh, as you know, till now we learned a lots of thing about React Router 6, but one thing is pending, and which is really important also, which is a uh, navigating programmatically. So what does that mean? So this simply means uh, how we can redirect or navigate on a any specific event. For example, uh, I have a button, and on the button click, I want to redirect my route from x page to y page how we can do that so we will learn in this part so let's start with the points so we will make two buttons and uh, then i will tell you how you can navigate on a button click after that how we can navigate from one page to another page on function calling and we'll discuss some important interview questions and i will also tell you that how you can uh, make navigation conditionally also right and this is my instagram account if you want to follow me there all right so uh, let's make two button first of all on home page so that we can uh, navigate on the button click so what i'm going to do i am adding a br tag and uh, then let me create a button and we can put here let's say go to about page or something and uh, let me copy it and paste it here so that we can save time and let's go to filter page now i am adding here on click event and on this on click i want to redirect from uh, my home page to the about us page so for that first uh, i need a hook which is use navigate and let's create an instance of it const uh, and we can put any name to this uh, use navigate hook navigate and uh, use navigate we can assign to this function or uh, this uh, constant now let's make a arrow function here and call this navigate function and inside it I can pass here uh, the URL way I where I want to redirect it which is about and now let's see is it working or not whenever i will click on the about page you can see that we redact it to the about page that's great and if i click on the filter it will not work because we did not applied that click on the filter so let's do the same thing here also and let's change it filter and uh, if i just click on a filter page now you can see that this is still working fine so that's great now let's say we have lots of button here and we want to react on, react on this button click so what we can do for that we can create a common function right so let me create a function uh, navigate to page or something and now what i can do here i can just simply uh, use this uh, navigate function and i can put here about let's say right and now and now, and now, and now we can call this function and for a moment let me just let me just let me just let me just, let me just, let me just correct navigate We don't need this parameter so i can remove it all right great so now let's try whenever i will just click on a about page it will going to the about page that's working fine if i click on the filter page it is still going to the about us page because you can see that we are calling same function on the on both of button clicks so what i can do here i can put here some condition so i know that this is a static condition but roughly you will get an idea that how we can provide a, a conditional navigation so let's say i have a const x is true and i will check here if x is true let's redirect to the about page here else we can navigate to the mm, 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 
filter page right and now let's try so still you will find that it will still going to the about us page so let's make this condition opposite and let's put it false and uh, now if we will click on the any of button you will find that we are jumping on filter page so i know that as i told you that this is static condition but uh, in the place of x there could be any state there could be any props so that could be dynamic thing right and uh, there is a one more simple way that for reduct it just remove all this stuff and uh, just take a parameter from this function and reduct to that parameter and let's pass this parameter from uh, button click uh, about and same thing what we can do here mm, 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 mm. filter so let's say i'm just clicking on a filter page it will perfectly go with the filter and now it will also go with the about so with that way we can just create the you can see that function calling navigation or you can say that dynamic navigation whatever you want to say so in interviews what kind of question they can ask they can ask that how you can apply the conditional navigation how you can navigate on a button click right these kind of question can be asked and thanks all for watching this video and please support me by subscribe my channel like this video and comment your valuable feedbacks thank you so much